Hello, this is Samuel Peacock, also known as Stick God on my YouTube channel, um, making a quick JavaScript tutorial, well, JavaScript and some CSS, basically to display this, uh, a simple clock system to run in most browsers. Uh, I'm going to get straight into it by making a div uh, with a class of uh, holder and inside that I'm going to stick a paragraph with an ID of clock display and a class of let's see clock style And inside of that, I'm going to stick some placeholders because for now I'm just going to set up the display, the CSS for it. Um, so I'm just save that. That should just display the numbers. Yep, that's it. Nice. Okay, now I'm going to go straight into the CSS. I already have the things ready for these. Um, so I'm going to stick font size of 100 pixels uh, font family of century gothic because that's one of my favorites um, let's see I need a background color All the E's should be a nice grey. Um, okay, we need a border of say two pixels solid and black. So that's all zeros. Alright, just check this for now. Homepage. This, yeah, and there we go. That displays this. Um, let's add a few more things to it. Let's see, we need display inline. Basically, takes it and wraps it to however, however meant like whatever size the text is. So it should put the edge of the border up to here. So save that. Yeah, there you go. Let's see, it does that to it. It's nice and handy. Okay, the new border radius should be about 20 pixels. Uh, puts a nice edge on each of the corners. And yeah, I think that's it for now. Oh, we also need to put uh, text align. text align center in the in the actual div itself will um, center it in the page so yeah, there we go and that's basically the start of it um, the next video I'm going to go through the CS uh, sorry the JavaScript to get it to load these numbers and in the video after that it, I'm going to show how to get it to refresh every second and fix um, an error in it basically Okay, uh, thanks for watching.